Bath water. Shit, there's Lena. Pretend you're someone important. Lay some uh, studio cool on her. Don't need acting pointers from you, Johnny. Uh, let me guess. Another stalker. How long have you been waiting here, hmm? All night? Want me to sign your pecs? Where's my crew? We're supposed to shoot, and they're not fucking here. Amateurs. <sighs> anyway, you want an autograph or something? I'm a talent scout for BD Syndicate, and boy, do I have the perfect role for you. We're piloting a new BD show, and if it takes off and you've got good chemistry with the co-star, we'll dive straight into full production. Whoa, slow down, guy. I might be easy, but I'm not cheap, and I always charge in advance. Did I mention who you'd be co-starring with? No, who? See for yourself. Fuck me! Carrie Uridine! And the girls from Uscrax! I take it we've got a deal? We do. Did you bring me my script? Uh, won't be needing one. It's all improvised. Sending you the address. I'll meet you there tonight. The producer, Shank, he'll be waiting for you on location. Uh, got to get ready, do my makeup, nails. Uh, thanks, sweetie. Ciao. And I had that photo because I did uh, Carrie's quest line. That's awesome. Lena comes off as a basic, basic uh, lady in her BDs, but apparently the real space, she's smarter than she looks and negotiates like an old-time fixer. Still, everyone knows her weak spot is Eddie's, and breaking into the BD big leagues, try using that to get your foot in the door. She's on the way. Get tool prepared. Not bad. I'll let you know when she's here. Once you're here for the scrolling too. Wait until tomorrow. You 
you take one right in the faceplate, let me rake in the damages. Uh, I don't know. Okay, let's wait. Move your Merc behind. Lina and Tual are already laying into each other. Need you to set teams, set them straight. Cause right now it's shouting match. <laughs> You're wearing my faceplate. You even copied my shoes. Have you no shame, bitch? I won't let this go. These looks are copyright protected, okay? You will be paying me for the rest of your life. Your looks, that's all? Yours? Bags, shoes, glasses, all custom made. Lina Melina is a registered trademark. You fucking copycat, bitch. Okay, like, this is fucking weird. How am I even supposed to act? <laughs> All right, people. Director on set. Someone's got to take the reins. So great to have you back. Tell him he's a clone and that he was made by the FIA. I don't know. It doesn't sound believable. It's all part of the plan. Go get him, Tiger. Isn't it weird we look so alike? You're a spitting image of me. You're just copying me. There, puzzle solved. Hmm. And you say you're the real Lina Malina? The one and only. Do you remember your parents? Your first period? Anything from your past before... Um, this? I... I don't... You're trying to gaslight me. I'm not. I would never. You can't remember because you're a clone. You were created in a biotechnical lab under the FIA's orders to take my place as an NUSA spy in Night City. My entire life? It's a lie? Wait. If you know who I am, then my cover must be blown. I'm a liability, not an asset. Oh god, they're going to kill me to wipe their tracks. That guy's acting was super convincing. He had like this weird vibe though. Ugh. Listen, I don't know if this is really my style. I'll think about it and get back to you. Thanks for this, though. Ciao! Didn't jive with her, huh? Yeah, this kind of dark political intrigue ain't really her brand. Well, that's my job done. Did my part. Of course, yeah. Transferring now. Gonna tune this and see if I can't turn it into something. Now I just got a fine tool for he causes any more trouble. Luckily, I set up parental controls on his tracker. Where'd you go, Butterbones? And I get a... Baby Boomer. <laughs> Let's see it. Has zero tolerance for losers. Every consecutive attack in a combo increases crit chance. Hey, honey buns, left you a little present at uh, Brainporium. It's a little some. It's a little something to remember me by. Thanks. Less than three. Tune into my BDs. New scrolls drop every week. Mr. Hands, kidnapping.
Don't know if it was worth getting involved. Turns out the client was a BD rental owner, goes by Tool. Shum had a psychotic break and thought he was Lena. Anyway, now he doesn't, but I might have accidentally given him some sort of persecution complex. I see. Would you like to pat on the back? A 21 gun salute? Well, you can have my mildest congratulations. Now kindly return to work. As your partner. If he's not his old self soon, I'm gonna have to close up shop. Can't do everything myself. Got anything that might interest me? Badlands Raid Ram Nugs Okay, time for this one. Reed, you copy? Made it to the hallway. Copy you loud and clear. I'm in position too. Tunnels must have been Hanson's idea. He probably lacked the manpower to secure all the passages. I found a breach in their defenses. I should be inside momentarily. Out.
Good thing I'm not claustrophobic. I figured out the patrol routes. Got them down. Set myself a safe path through and past them. the outpost. Approaching warehouse gate now.
sure it's in the system? Because if it is, then either it's been stolen or I'm just fucking blind. Just keep looking. Shit's on my list. Plain as fucking day. V, you still there? Sure am. I'm at the warehouse gate. You'll need to secure the area, crack it open from the other side. Area secure. Essentials only. No, goddammit. We gotta split before dawn. Already told you. Boss found it in my locker. If we don't leave... Would you just listen to me for a second? If we don't blow town before tomorrow, I'm fucking dead. Do you understand that? Yes, it's that serious. Look, I need to go, okay? Bye. But these need delivering, Chum. Not through here, they don't. <laughs> VIPs only. So where am I supposed to? Do I look like the fucking hotel receptionist to you? Other entrance. <laughs> Pfft, delivery. Did you spot anything interesting? Liquor boxes and such. And you collected our tax? Of course. Ah, oh, there you are. We've got some important guests in downtown. Here by my What's the sitch? See a gate, two guards. Don't worry about them. Jimmy, open that gate. There you go. Attention all downtown residents, this is Kurt Hansen. 
Roger that. It's gotta be checked out. Careful! Someone's lurking! Where are those gunks? See this? Someone was fucking around here. Think we got visitors. Scared. This is Hanson's surf. He has the upper hand. It's just a fact that needs accepting. Does it mean I'm shaking at the knees? Hell no. Alright, find a vantage point to have eyes on me. Neutralize any and all threats. Call and quiet. Dropped the sniper, nesting in his perch now. Had the perfect vantage point, saw everything. Cover me. You're in prime duck hunting position. New user detected. Calibration in progress. Firing mode inactive. I'm in position. Do you have a visual on me? I got you. What now? We do this nice and quiet if we can, got it? Spot any guards in my way? Give me a heads up. Don't worry, boss. Rifle sports a silencer if it comes to that. Better look around. Cam's galore here. Should have access once the sniper's nest completes calibration. Good. They could prove useful. Got a mine just past the corner. Well spotted. I could have missed it. Healthy smattering of guards along your path. Copy that. We'll take them out one by one. Best if they never knew we were here. See the main elevator shaft. Too risky. There'll be sentries up top. Keep an eye on it, though. I've got eyes in a sniper. Further down. He's not a threat yet. We'll deal with him later. See a bunch of containers. Could use them to get to your side. Yeah, see him too. Let me build that bridge. There's a service elevator nearby. We'll take that up. Gotta get there first, though. Cover me. Calibration complete. Firing mode active.
Don't forget, hallway's mined. Besides that, the coast is clear. Understood. Moving out. Fine work. I can't see around the corner. All clear? Am I okay to move on? Patrol incoming. Copy that. Moving towards cover. Detector ahead. Can't get around it. Handle it, will you? Sensor disabled. Good work. Proceeding forward. Surveillance system link established. I need an assist. You take the guard on the left. And the wall's mine. Focus on my target, V. Got a clear shot. On my mark. Three. Heads up. Sizable patrol headed your way. Copy that. Moving towards cover. Good work. Proceeding forward. Visual. Thanks. I'm in position. Guards in view. Do you see that cam above me? We can flip it on. Camera's mine. Good. Tag out target and fire. The rifle should punch right to them. You there? I wanna see where is this one. Okay. Guards down. Smooth work. Patrol incoming. Got eyes on him. Heard that too. The guards could have spotted me, V. I need you to deal with them before they're on me. Clear. You can make your way to the bridge. Fine work. Don't blow our cover.
What is this? Tech sniper rifle, the thing that I love. Tsunami is once again a leader in arms tech innovation. Why? Charged rounds now penetrate through enemies and will bend their trajectory to hit multiple enemies simultaneously. And it has more damage by default. And if I were to upgrade it, look at that. Awesome. Silky smooth work, V. Well played. I'm impressed. Let's head to the elevator. Follow me. Almost there, V. Fucking finally. You're looking a little pale. A little deja vu is all. Different elevator, different hotel. The sits didn't turn out great. What makes you say that? It's my job to notice things like this. How many ops you been on? Ballpark. One of the number of years you've been around. But right now, we're crashing the party of a bad boy dictator. While aiming to walk out with his prized possession. Dress up time. Throw on your new threads. And plaster on your best fake smile. A party awaits. set. Yeah, you're a real looker. Now come on. Oh, he even reacts uh, if you look yourself in the mirror. That's cool. That's a nice little detail. Champagne tastes like. 
I'll be at the bar if you need me. So, Alaska. And now what? You putting all that kit back on the market, or you got a buyer lined up already? Wouldn't mind offloading the IFVs to some statelet. Time for an upgrade, know what I mean? And the rest, I got a use for it. I in this piece of turf, right for the plucking. Hmm, in our backyard somewhere? The beautiful and exotic Myanmar. Politically, the country's a mess, but the gemstone deposits, rubies, jade, sapphires, <laughs> drool just thinking about it. We'll burn some villages and add some warlords, put their heads out on spikes, you know, just generally take charge. I'll drink to that. Fucking hyenas. Each and every one. Telling ya. Won't be long now we'll be hearing about dangerous terrorists in Myanmar threatening our way of life. Then about the urgent need to install a democratic government there. Can't see shit. Thanks. Look who it is. Here as well, Hans? Indeed. It's better if we're not seen together. I don't know you, but enjoy your evening. Just saw Hans. Look me like he's here on a mission of his own. He likely is. I just tell him the business gathering intel. Excellent work. They appear unaware of both the security breach and their uninvited guest. I'm impressed, V. Well, thank you. So I took her to a clinic. 
Nick, and I told them to do a full faceplate conversion. Whatever she wants, just do it. I don't care. If she wants a gator's face, fine. Throw in a nice set of sharp white teeth while you're at it, huh? Know what they said? Exotics went out of style three decades ago. These days, everybody wants... Well, you know what. I just fucking lost it. I'm talking to myself horse for serious sums. And some ripper quack is gonna explain fashion trends to my daughter. In the end, they shut their traps and gave me a discount. But I had to disown her. I mean, if she wants to inherit my money, she'll have to look like human royalty. And the other mods? On her now. Thanks. Aim to get fucked up on Hanson's dime, then puke all over his carpets? Respect. Here you are. Thank you. Thanks. The table is come on, code. come on. One more minute. One minute. more. Breathe. Relax. The system is foolproof. This table is full. Please join another. Thank you. I saw you, simping for that mangy slut from N54. Honey, I was just being nice. Ugh. They don't pay you to be nice. You're supposed to be tending to business. You know, I could tell Carlos I talked to the cartel alone again because my husband caught a whiff of available pussy. Tell you what, I'll talk to Carlos. Just so happens the mangy slut from N54 disclosed some shit he'll be very interested in hearing, honey. You claim Kurt was pleased, so I'm puzzled why he withheld his support, if only in your negotiations with the bald twerp from the consulate. I think he wished to appear neutral, for public consumption, of course. We didn't put two ministers behind bars to have him appear neutral now. That ship has sailed. Mumbai branch is losing patience fast. Remind him tomorrow. Naturally, of course. Well, here goes nothing. The same? Uh, again? again? Gambling. This, I swear. Unbelievable. Starting tomorrow. In the flesh. More mud than alpha.
Enjoy. Thanks. Santo Domingo. Nobody cares about Santo Domingo. My people tell me that all land transit to and from Night City passes through here. Who cares about land transit? We own the port, the docks, the airport. The airport's also ours. That the nomads battle over the highway with 6th Street. I could make two million a day on Metroplex runs alone. You and my friends over there, all we need to do is team up. Hmm. We'll have to think about it. In my day, no competition. Soviet mob was the worst scum. Human trafficking, murder for hire, torture-based debt collection. Shit sounds bad as is, but they actually managed to turn the horror up and not. Hey, we saw these two guys in uh, Judy's quest. I let them live. I wonder what happens uh, if I get rid of them. Who's gonna be here if I get rid of them? Huh. I'll have to do that on the next playthrough. That's cool, that's cool. Maiko, there she is. She's also here. Okay, who else can we find here? What other familiar faces? V, this guy looks exactly like your Roman. Unfucking Kenny. Sure that ain't Takamura. Okay. Just one more. Yes. Your drinks up. It's the comedian guy. You look exactly like my friend, Goro Takamura. Did he also just get out of rehab? Lost his employer recently. They were close. He's adjusting to his new life. Not easy for a guy like him. Had him not to lose hope. If one is industrious, there is no shortage of work in Night City. Maybe your friend would like to try his hand at show business. I could use a double for rainy days. <laughs> Might actually take you up on that. I'll let him know. Watch out. I will hold you to your word. Thanks a lot. Cool. I seen you on the feeds warning people about the relic God's light shine upon you Even the pastor warning people about the relic on the feeds made the appearance Maybe he's here to save Hanson or we'll collect donations from his church end of the day that money still money.
Wild and Hall. There have been variables to consider. There are this campaign, new investigation. No, no, I, I know that it was specially done for us. Payment is not an issue. I just need the paperwork to prevent it. Is there no alternative? Here's the deal. Either we got some proof of purchase, or there's another path. Non-violent, actually. Meaning what, exactly? Meaning you sue us. Take us to court. Put on a show for the people. I'm prepared to testify that this, uh, undertaking was commissioned by City Hall. We will discuss this at a later time. Of course, I'm always open to compromise. Um, uh, yes? What is it? Mr. Holt, elections come and gone. You wound up on the short end. How are you holding up? Well, I don't treat it as a loss, you see. To me, it's a minor setback. I'm so sorry. Uh, what was I saying? Stage entrance, artists only. This isn't about who has the right credentials. You just have to speak Hanson's language. You think Hanson will agree to revitalize 10% of the zone because of a few trumped up military slogans? That's not what I mean. He needs to be shown his projected profits and losses in plain writing, without any sugar coating. So you think I'm sugar coating? You signed a contract with Night City, well done. Just leave Hanson to me, because, no offense, I know you'll find a way to cock it up. Ah, the dream of restoring Pacifica to its intended glory lives on. Overheard some investors. Ready to watch their cash disappear into Hanson's pockets. Great of them. We need equipment that can withstand and remain reliable in extremely low temperatures. Our Argentinian friends made me aware of that. We've reached an initial agreement for 30 air defense systems, 500 armored vehicles, and 100 combat avians. In addition to that, personnel equipment for 5,000 operators, as well as two nuclear submarines. In 2078 is our current ETA. Mm -hmm. a, a little late. What about testing? It's the testing that determines the date. You can have everything by January, but with lower quality testing. I understand. We'll iron out the details, I'm sure. The scale of biz being conducted here. It's overheard an arms deal. Enough gear to outfit a private army. I'm not surprised. Look around. Run your eyes over the faces. Regalia. You got foreign ambassadors, Banana Republic dictators, revolutionaries in waiting, corporate heads. It's precisely those kind of needs Hanson and company are here to fulfill. otherwise. I want three more shipments before the end of the month. Three's a lot. This is not up for debate. Either you set up three for takedown, or tomorrow morning, start kicking down your doors. <laughs> NCPD chief's cutting a deal with the 6th Street boss. Not even trying to hide it. Party's a microcosm of Night City. 
NCPD's a gang like any other, except it's listed on the stock exchange. self-made man, borrowed a hundred grand from my parents and invested it in myself. Didn't go spending it all on sin coke and expensive ass, but on implants and training. Gave it all back the second I could. Exactly, it's about self-discipline and ambition. If you're poor, you really have no one to blame but yourself. Welcome. Would you care for some champagne? Don't mind if I do. A pleasant evening to you. What's so surprising about me being here? Yes, what is it? Jillian Jordan and Arif Iqbal. In the flesh and together, no less. Just want to say hi. Um, hey. Um, uh, where were we? What's so surprising? Um, uh, where were we? Jillian, dear, there's nothing smart about shooting your boss down over your own turf. Not to mention proving incapable of then finishing the job. Keep your fucking voice down. You were just singing Hansen's praises for his civility. Are we now back to scary maniac? Say what you want, Aerith. Just don't come crying if you get kicked out of the party of the year. <laughs> You're the one accusing him of attempting to murder President Rosalind Myers in front of millions of viewers, no less. That's the job, as we all know. Fucking reading words off a prompter for the gonk messes. Whereas here, my friend, here, words actually matter. What now? Um, uh, where were we? Mr. Kavorkin. Uh, do I know you? Sorry, I have an important hollow to make. Yeah, all the hottest markets. Analysis, information integration, candlestick patterns detection, indicator search. Watch sure, your it's free. Familiar. Very funny. Face. Who do you think you I am? This the world. It's an adrenaline kick. They get off on it. Well, Nancy no, it's just supposed to look free. Hand. That's the whole angle. We'll talk more tomorrow, Mom. Yeah, love you too. Bye. Thanks. I guess that's all of them. 
Let me just double check and then continue. Hey, you look a little lost. Ruth Singh? The one and only. <laughs> you wouldn't feel like keeping me company for the rest of the evening, would you? Night's still young. Later, maybe. Right. Okay. That should be it. What now? I know as much as you do. All she said was to come here. She'll either find us or she left us something. And you, what's your play? I think I'm starting to feel the vibe. Just remember what we're here for. To my right, Booth's far back behind the stairs. The guy in the fatigues looks like he came here straight from a firing range. Owner of the Black Sapphire, Mr. D-Town himself, Kurt Hansen, clearly having a great night in the company of the NCPD commissioner. PA broadcast, he fiercely anti-law enforcement. It's an act. Behind closed doors, he's rubbing elbows and patting backs of NCPD's top brass. Avoid him. Especially in the confrontation. Beside that, stay visible. Songbird said she'd find us here. Let's give her a chance. I'll grab a drink and look around. Open line on comms. Don't press anyone too hard. We need to keep Would up appearances. For a drink? Look like you're having fun. Gin and tonic, please. Say, I'm looking for a friend. You're supposed to meet me here. Huh. Okay. Does your friend have a name. Song saw me. Korean lady. Around 30. Hmm. Have you seen her around? On the floor, I think. Was she alone? Was she? No. No, she's with Colonel Hansen, I think. But he's in sight with other people now, and she ain't one of them. Yeah, I can see that. Have one on me later, yeah? Thanks. Look up on the mezzanine. As you wish, sir. V, it's good you're here. Not what you expected, huh? Is it the haircut? Dress looks good on you. Thank you. That was the surprising bit, I'm sure. It's so good you're here. Don't know what I'd do without you, V. Really. Good to finally meet you in the flesh, face to face. Where our last convo ended was troubling. The, uh, runner. 
Your friend, who helped us reconnect last time, killed him, fried him, didn't I? You didn't kill Slider. Blackwall did. Lucky as hell it didn't flatline you too. I ran out of time to explain everything. Saul, I've made so many mistakes. It's all right, Saul. Not your fault. The blame's on us, all of it. On you? I is all of them. I know what they made you do. They pushed and pushed, and I, I wasn't there to stop it. We'll talk later. First order of business, we pull you out of here. That's not happening. It is. We got in, we can get out. Just Not the me. point. I'm dying, Saul. Like V. Hansen has the cure we need. We run now, we both die. Relic's killing V. Blackwall's my poison. I can't bow out now. Got a plan. Hear it in your voice. Yeah. One I can't hope to enact without your help. Hansen pulled some tech out of a bunker under Dogtown. Tech that could cure both V and me. We need to clep it. Only way I see of doing that is to stay close. Play the prisoner. So fuck. We'll wait for an opportunity and pounce. I'll be on the inside, ask for your help when the time's right. I can flee once I have that tech. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Huh. So me. Care to introduce your friends? It's not often I'm simply not familiar with guests attending my own party. And I never forget a face. Kurt Hansen. Name's V. Just V. Haven't seen so me in years. Trying to catch up. Oh, that's what this is. To me, reunions consist of picking up the broken, scattered shards of your heart. Or teeth. Always hurts. Well, I need to grab you, darling. I have a couple NC politicos here who are dying to meet you. And if we're to keep hungry rats from devouring Dogtown, we really do need to feed them the occasional scraps. I'm all yours, Kurt. See you soon, V. Oof. Praying it worked. Reestablished our link the moment I touched you. Interesting. I need a minute to process. And I need a drink. Heading downstairs. I'll explain everything. Just need you to listen. What's the deal, Song? Doubt I've ever seen a prisoner parade around in a cocktail dress at a swanky party. Not to mention being hella friendly with their captor. It's a charade, V. Doing what I need to survive, to get what I want. I'm letting Hansen show me off like his personal trophy. V, I... I can't explain everything now. It's too much, but I really do need your help. All I want is to get that cure for us. It's what I've been chasing all along. Not liking this. Not a bit. I don't like my situation either. It's very shit for all three of us. There, I said it. The cure. How do we get it? We need the neural matrix. Secret tech that incorporates AIs from beyond the black wall. The Matrix is nested in a mainframe Hansen pulled out of the bunker. The mainframe secured, but Hansen lacks the key. That's the problem. Neural Matrix. What is it exactly? In short, it's storage. A carrier for an AI trapped within certain boundary conditions. 
When the AI is triggered, it'll execute what's stipulated within those conditions. But I really can't go into detail now. We don't have the time. Got a plan, spill it. Hansen needs me and a duo of runners who worked on this tech in the past. They actually grabbed access codes they're willing to unload for a price. Classic black market shit. They're bringing access, I'm bringing know-how about how to pull the matrix and data off the mainframe. We're to work side by side, giving us a chance. You clip the access codes, then get the runners out of the way. You'll then impersonate them for a meet with Hansen. Say meet or we'll swipe the Matrix out from under his nose. So, runners. We're to impersonate him? How? Personality theft tech. Arm kind of specializes in it. Alex and Reed know it well. They'll explain. Of all people, couldn't have imagined those two would be on our side, helping. This job, this whole story about Hansen, not adding up something fearsome. You're hiding something, still. I don't have time to explain the ins and outs now. V, please, we need the Matrix. Focus on the runners, find them. They're here, downstairs. Red-headed twins, walled to the teeth with ice. Crochet scans will show you bunk. You're blowing me off. Champagne glass over there. Prep some intel for you. Get it to read. You'll need it later. Really need to go now, V. I'm counting on you. Songbird. And she's gone.
What an awesome performance. Stage is off limits. Step away, please. Would you care for a drink? I'm on the walk of shame, but I feel no shame. Hit me with something strong. Japanese whiskey, perhaps. I have an excellent single malt. Here you are. Come back if you need anything. Seems your special agent has special needs, trying to drown his sins and sorrows. Talk to Songbird via the relic. We can communicate again. Mm. You all good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe at Myers' head. What are you thinking? Don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Hmm. <laughs> what you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. And it took you just one drink to cobble that together. Started seeing the pieces falling into place up on the mezzanine. So Omi told her she's dying. Things follow from that. She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to. Before any of this went down. Traded the president's life for access to the tech. The NUS Prez sold to a crime lord. Huge if true. Myers pressured Somi to reach further, breach boundaries. And then Somi snapped. Don't know about that. Song recruited me specifically to pull Myers out of that wreck. Seriously doubt she wanted her dead or snatched by Hanson. It's never that simple, V. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hanson and you. 
She has Hansen set. Then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always her strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. Still trust her. Trust she'll keep her word. Promise me the cure, and I fully intend to get it. Only thing that matters, really. I'd be careful. Mind sharp. Eyes and ears attuned. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. So, what are you thinking about all this? I'm not convinced Somi's to blame for everything. In this trade, nothing's ever as it seems. You gotta keep asking questions till you get to the bottom of it. That's experience talking. Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch. Then we'll see which direction to take. Right. Still should watch your every move closely. Sure. Unconditional trust? No more. Out the window. Right. Back to the sitch at hand. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hansen. Prep for it's required. Cause we show up as a pair of runners. Need to collect their identities first. Whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? So, how's one go about it? Clepping someone's personality. FIA Menanthropic Tech. Alex has access. You seem to use it already. You look, sound, and act like the individual whose personality you assume. To do it, we need scans of our targets. Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Our targets are a brother and sister, red haired twins. They're here somewhere, schmoozing. Hmm. Okay, we need to pull data, get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, scan as we talk. Got it, I think. So, time to make our move? Over there. <laughs> wow. Traced them in a the flash, Reed. Noticed them some time ago. They stand out even in this mountain pot. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear. Prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. V, zip and funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach, and we're strangers. Let's get to this. Struck gold with roulette, really. Gambling throws people around, high and low, brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Hansen and Hounds will be cheapest. No corporate overhead. His price is the lowest. 
just structurally. What do you think he'll do with them? I don't care. Do you? Please. Just in case you're still wondering why I hate corporate rats and politivores. You're a hired gun and petty thief, but I'd say your presence at this party is still raising the moral bar. Sir. Wanna buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. V, important. You're not there to have fun. Simple bets, red or black only. None of the double street or basket bullshit. Understood? Understood. Three. Will you join us? Red. Place your bets, please. Betting's open. By all means. Make it red. Relax. Buy him drinks, break the ice. I'll join you momentarily. All bets are in. Bidding is closed. What? No introduction? V. You? Aurore Cassel. And that boar is my brother, Emeric. How's things? Any luck? We started just moments ago. What's your poison? My treat. A bourbon for me. Alas, mon frère does not drink. You heard the lady. And real water for the gentleman here. And what'll you have? Same as the lady. Bourbon coming up. Your drinks will be here shortly. 31. Odd. Black. Et merde! Place your bets, please. Last chance. Let's go, let's go. Red. V. Can't get a hold of Reed. No idea where he is. Stall for time, okay? Hmm, I just realized. Uh, you must have dirt beneath your fingernails too. Like all these bastards and bitches. That is, unless you're a tourist. Like the no-lifers who must watch others live to feel anything. Provocative. Got me. No lifer. Tourist. Whatever your preference. <laughs> You're just teasing. 25. Odd. Red. A defeat. Duh! Fichy. Fucking done here! Duh! <sighs> Place your bets, please. Can't help feeling I interrupted something when I walked up. Do not worry yourself about this. Oh, come, come. V is just being cordial. N'est-ce pas, V? You weren't snooping just now, 13. were you? Odd. Black. Still no sign from Reed, V. Got a sinking feeling about this. Place your bets, please. Eight. Sure wasn't snooping, no. Just being plain courteous. Oh, don't be such a bore. I simply don't like bores. Of course you were snooping, as we are simply too interesting to ignore. Listen, Reed's MIA for now, can't wait for him. Gotta do both scans on your own. We were discussing local politics, specifically our host, Monsieur Kurt Hansen. 
Big fish selling big guns for big money. Yet here you have celebrities, politicians, even the chief of police. So I was thinking, uh, perhaps Hansen would do better by being a veritable businessman, no? I claim he would. Mon cher frère disagrees. 36. Even. Red. Ugh. Guess it's not my lucky day. Place your bets, please. Who is Kurt Hansen really? A crucial question. Tread carefully with that duo, V. The fuck? Psychoanalysis a hobby of yours? No, putain. I'm merely trying to have a conversation. V, no. Too hard. I'm asking what you think of him, not if his parents loved him. Don't know the guy that well, really. Honest. I like it. Better this than invented nonsense. Nice little dodge, V. 28. Even. Black. Place your bets, please. Tu ne serais pas en train de devenir trop pote avec lui? Mais fais pas ton jaloux, petit frère. C'est pas comme si Anna les baisait, lui et moi. Charming little show you're putting on. <gasps> you see, Amrik, we are charming. I mean, Hansen could take Dog down by the throat, eject the junkies, and make it a paradise for billionaires. Just getting rich is dull. You should work for the community, invest, create jobs, throw banquettes. She's getting chatty. Doing good, V. And charities are excellent washing machines. You launder billions, believe me. 32. Even. Red. Place your bets, please. And you're so childish. It's beautiful. What? Hansen going missionary position in business? Nonsense. <sighs> Reed's still not responding. But you keep working it. Let's go. Swap twins. Man basically owns Dogtown. Could use that as leverage. And who would Hanson be? The mayor? Oh, please. He is very good at what he does. A professional criminal. Soldier yesterday, crime lord today. Why not biz shark tomorrow? Yet he is a businessman. And to make it legal? It is a lot of work to do for a simple change of label. Good. Little worms opening up. Fourteen. Even. Eh ben Meg. voilà, c'est comme ça qu'on fait. Place your bets, please. Care to expand? Floor is yours. Allow me to say, V. Arms or property, it would make no difference to me what I sell. And to spend five years on efforts to uh, change how people see you, call you, to be upstanding in the eyes of others, I could not give a shit. Twenty, even, black. Place your bets, please. Getting there, almost got it. Give me something big now. Make them laugh or cry, I don't care. Please, please. Like the tingle of risk. Oh, mon vieux, t'as pas d'idée. Thinking we can add a little spice to our game. I'm listening. My, my, I too, I'm curious. How about we go all in? Bet everything we won tonight. <gasps> and we play different colors, yes? You win or we do. And either you or we lose all. My thoughts exactly. A moment. You join the table, buy drinks, talk and talk. Now you wish to risk everything? I find this disquieting. Perhaps you could now tell us about yourself. Tread lightly. Name's V. Afterlife affiliated. Make what you will of it. Oh, are you happy now? 
You choose first, then. I'm seeing red coming. Black for us, then. Some you lose some, folks. Leave us for a moment, if you please. A goodbye, then. I know your friend Reed is FIA. My natural assumption is you're an agent, too. I'm also guessing you two took it upon yourselves to save the president. Then exfil her out of Dogtown. I should send you back to Night City in body bags, filled with pieces. You trying to scare me? Dunno. Are you afraid? We're just talking, aren't we? Wow, you cracked it. Clever man. To be honest, I got tired of the media circus. All the allegations thrown in my face. The bullshit propaganda. Luckily, we can put all that behind us now. Always willing to help. Don't you worry. Got your back, Colonel. I will let you and Reed walk free of this place. In one piece. On your own two feet. Consider it a gesture of my goodwill. Your little bird came to me on her own, though. She was tired of breaking international laws on the president's whim. She simply had to run away. Breaching the black wall, jeopardizing the net, all humankind's safety, in fact, for personal gain? I wonder what Netwatch would say. Pass it on to President Myers. Also tell her, her toy of mass destruction is my friend now. And she should get the fuck out of my backyard, or the world will learn about her games. I've matters to attend to. You'll find Mr. Reed downstairs. Okay, V. Got all we need. Okay. What do I do now? Haul ass out of there. Son of a bitch said I'd find Reed downstairs. Yeah, heard him. Wasn't crazy about his tone. Time to evac, V. Best not tempt the fates. Head to the elevator, ride down to one. Need to know what's up with Saul. Hey, look who it is. You're going to eat something, Lizzie. No buts. You can't run on empty forever. <laughs> Let it go, Avi. I'm a firecracker on an empty stomach. You know that. <laughs> and the night is young. I just don't want you to pass out. Just tell me where we're off to after we're done here. Right. We AV out to the island. We'll hop onto a plane and fly out over the Pacific. The Pacific? Not a terribly precise destination, Avi. To a private aircraft carrying yacht, with its own tracking system. So we'll be flying full autopilot. Ah, adventure, yes! Hope you're as excited as I am. Hey there, Lizzie. V, what are you doing here? Could legitimately ask you the same. <laughs> yeah, I might be a little out of place. But I get around. And Dogtown, well, it always gets my blood coursing. 
Fortunately, I have darling Avi here. Avi's my new bodyguard. The best I've ever had, if a little too overprotective. Pleasure, Avi. Headset's Nova, Lizzie. <laughs> like it? Here, it's yours, Ben. For real? Sure, got loads of them. You'll look like you're on Team Wiz Wiz. It's liable to take you places. I want you to have it. Oh, thanks. Wow. Thanks, Lizzie. Looking like you're about to delta out of here. Making my exit soon, yeah. But from one party on to another. A chum of mine from Lagos is throwing one on his yacht. Friends, fireworks, diving, a private fashion show. Hmm. Shame. Some R&R &R out on the water would do you good. But I'm sure you're like super busy. Plus, knowing him, there's gonna be drama, so I'm totally sparing you. Totally. Thanks. Next release. Planned, uh, maybe in the works already? Kinda. For now, though, I'm obsessed with galaxies, nebulae, and sea turtles. Uh-huh. Care to elaborate? <laughs> v, with that, you know more than my producer. Patience, please. You'll just have to wait. Hey, how you holding up? Last time we saw each other was, uh, you know. I'm doing great. Really inspired lately. Never felt better. Yeah. Never felt better. Hope it stays that way. Enjoy your evening, Lizzie. Take care, V. And you keep skating along that edge. So fun! I'll be ready to bug out of here in five. Up to you, though. Oh, it's up to me? Come on. Don't act like you enjoy the jawing of these podium pounders and career criminals. Yeah. Thought as much. In that case, I'm gonna hollow the landing pad. Unless there's anyone else you want to talk to. Well, I was hoping to have a word with Kurt about that. Other ways. I can talk to him for you. No, don't bother. Another time, I suppose. You know, you shouldn't be talking to him at all. That man means danger, even for Lizzie Wizzy. You know my thoughts on this. All too well. That mean you'll listen? You <laughs> are please. Let's see anyone new here. Almost all are located already. Thanks. Ugh, fuck, what now? Look at that helmet.
What a headdress. Are you one of the dancers? Thank you. I got it from Liz Wiz. Cool. NPCs react to it. Cool. No need to worry. Routine verification. Please enjoy your evening. Thinking about what that prick said. Guy knows. Got some dirt on Myers. Can't imagine it happening. But if the public learns that any U.S. president willingly broke international laws governing cyberspace use... And USA's fucked. Myers will either have to take the fall, let herself be buried in dirt for this, or she'll defy the world and spark another war. Fuck me. Songbird's a walking, talking WMD. And Hanson's got her on a tight leash. And he can prime her for use whenever he wants. Listen, V, we need to get her out. For everyone's sake. Oh, just once I'd like to see things go smoothly, as planned. This feels so very, very wrong. 